Greetings everybody, Ricardo and I have arrived at Z Electric Vehicles. We are freezing our butts off out here in Westover, West Virginia, just across a bridge from Morgantown, West Virginia. Let's take a look at what we have inside Z Electric Vehicles, also known as Zev. Yes, this is uh, by far you know, our most popular, as far as just people love to, to look at it. You know, it's, it's we've only been making this for a few months now, so it's hard to tell its sort of total velocity of sales, but you know, we've gotten, you know, millions of views on YouTube and stuff. This is just, it's so different than any, like, and we get, you know, when I drive it down the street, you'll see people will, they'll point and like, they'll stop what they're doing. You know, there was one guy one time, his like jaw literally fell open. You know, we got, um. So I got I got pulled over by the police in this three times because they just wanted to know what the heck is that. How many passengers can you fit behind? There's also the uh, windshield wiper on the front too. Yeah, it's got a windshield wiper. <laughs> what is the top speed on this one? Uh, this one will go 40. Yeah. The driver's side and passenger side window go down. Mm -hmm. You have a sunroof that pops up, and then we have a back window that ventilates as well. Correct. Yeah. Right now, we are getting in, we are in the back of the Zev T3 Micro. Uh, imagine it as an electric tuk-tuk, like you would see uh, a three-wheeled vehicle riding around in uh, India. So, you're, so you just turn the key and it's on, but yeah. there is no, other than that, you see and they're, they're the dashboard. They're completely silent when they're, uh, when they're standing still. So. I'm trying to move, yeah. Yep. seats have seat belts, but the front seat does not. Yeah, they, they, they all have seat belts. They do. I mean, not that I would be much on seat belt wearing anyway. So in this particular vehicle, set up the way it is, what should I expect from my top speed, approximately? Uh, With the current battery and the current motor and the current programming, I would expect 35 to 40. With the three of us in here, you're probably going to get closer to 35. Yeah, you pack, you know, five, 600 pounds in a vehicle. You got to expect your performance numbers to decrease a little bit. It feels golf cartish. <clears throat> it's a wide stance on the handlebars. It's a little disconcerting. I'm inside, but I'm on a what feels like a motorbike. So, it, you know, it takes a little getting used to. Has a nice turning radius there. Work my reverse gear. As far as the power, it feels golf cartish. You know, we're doing 25 miles an hour. Um, and I don't mean, you know, your typical at the golf course golf cart. I mean, you know, the, the ones that people use to do 30 and 40 miles an hour around their uh, retirement communities. Hey, I'm Anthony, the Vehicle Hunter. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube page and please like us on Facebook. Vehicle Hunter.